Hey, what's going on, guys and girls? I'm Colleague Phoenix here, and welcome to episode number 12 of my Valheim Season 2 modded Let's Play series. Today, I want to first create the Draugr bow if I can, which I probably don't have any ancient wood. So, that's something we've got to go get. We'll go get some ancient wood. I've just collected some wood off camera. So, I had wood for making arrows. I want to make. Uh, probably a bunch of needle arrows, and if we can upgrade the Draugr bow quite a bit, that would be sweet as well. Uh, we need... it really doesn't matter which swamp we go to. We're just getting this ancient wood, should be pretty straightforward. Uh, we should have a decent selection of trees to pick from. There we go, this will work perfectly. Just for us to get some ancient wood from them. Preferably not in the water. For obvious reasons. There we go. I can't believe we didn't find any ancient bark in the few crypts we went through, actually. Normally you would find some at least. But we got nothing. Oh god, it keeps going in the water. Not that it matters, because you're just constantly wet in the swamp anyway. I don't think we get any ancient bark out of this. I think we just get normal wood from the stump. Yeah, it seems to be the case. Please fall straight and not go in the water. Okay, fall backwards. That works too. I don't know how much ancient bark we're going to need to upgrade this thing a few times. I know we're going to need a decent bit of silver, which silver's not too bad to get. We can always get more of that. If we have to. But I'd like to get this upgraded a few times over, at least. It's going to fall to the left, isn't it? Yep. Straight into the water. Yeah, we get this upgraded a few times, at least, I hope. Not getting that much ancient bark per tree. Oh. The tree's trying to kill me. Wood cutting at 36. What is our bow stat at, actually, out of curiosity? Bows, 27. Eh. Not as high as I'd like, but we've been using a lot of sword combat, haven't we? We're at level 40 with the sword. Oh, god damn it. Oh, there's a leech in the water. I hear it. I think. I'm not worried about the stumps because they're not giving us anything apart from just normal wood, and we just got a bunch of that. We don't really need a ton more. We can avoid that pretty much. Alright, well, we got... F I want to get a 50 stack. I feel like a 50 stack should then hopefully be enough. Possibly. If we can get 50 of it, I think we'll be pretty good. Oh, that's the first enemy I've seen. Surprisingly, no leeches. Really would have thought we would have encountered a few more of those, but that hasn't seemed to have been the case. This is going to fall straight into the water too. Yep. And I'm just going to whiff my shot on it too. Just going to get this guy killed. Oh. There we go. Well, we've got over 50. Hopefully... Oh, there's a leech. Hopefully that's enough. I don't know how much ancient bark it's going to use for upgrades. It might just use straight silver. But I don't, I don't really remember. But if we can get the bow leveled up nearly all the way, that would be pretty dope. Get the bow nearly leveled all the way up and then get some needle arrows. Because you never know what kind of uh, power up this this dragon could have. It could be something incredibly horrible to deal with. Alright, so let's make the Draugr Fang. And let's upgrade the Draugr Fang. It uses a bit of everything. We got it to plus three. We're just short on silver to go to plus four. That's 53 pierce plus 15 poison versus 35 pierce. So it's a considerable amount better than what we had. Oops. There you go on this one. And that goes down there. All right. That's cool. That's cool. That's not bad. Uh, that can go in the swamp chest. 
Not bad. We could try... Uh, what do we got in the way of magic? Uh, we'd need a legendary rune stone to enchant it. Not a legendary or rare rune stone. We got enough essence, we'd need a bit more dust. And we need five of these magic rune stones, which means we'd need to kill Ike the five more times. Which it could do. That's, you know. It might not be a bad idea just to do that, actually. Quickly get that over and done with. It won't take long, not with this sword. It's over pretty quick if you get a power attack on him. Basically kills him nearly instantly. So we can head over and do that. Oh, hi, little Grayling. What are you doing? Apart from getting absolutely murdered. Oh, yeah, I cut some trees down over here. I never finished them. That's what that is. So I hope you guys and girls have been having a good day, all that kind of stuff. I actually kind of feel not too crash hot today. Um, I didn't get an episode out yesterday because I was busy, and today I just feel like total butthole. Pretty not good. Pretty not good. Let's make the sacrifice. Can we just spawn multiple at a time? Apparently not. Alright. Let's get a big, big boy power attack on this guy straight off the rip. You're an elementalist. He does one damage to me. Man, it's so, it's so weird how you, you go from absolutely getting wrecked potentially by bosses to just murdering them in a matter of seconds. Come on. It's such an interesting change. Actually, only need to kill him. Well, that got me three? Actually, only need to kill him a couple times. Because this should give me two. The shielded, huh? How's, how's that working out for you? You didn't even get an attack off before you got murdered. How's the shielded going? And it's going to give me a me and antler pickaxes as well. I might just kill him a few more times. This is a two star boy. This is a two star boy. I forgot what. He's on fire because my sword does fire damage. That's right. I forgot about that. I think mode is weak to fire, if my memory serves me correctly, because, you know, frost and stuff, you know. So. I think, um. I think we could be good there. Definitely might take her down a lot faster. Also got a uh, rare drop. And a flint knife. And a deer cape. And a shield. A wood shield. I'm just doing this just to get them over and done with. Alright, we got a bunch of them dead. Now let's go to sacrifice and let's sacrifice all these trophies. I just accidentally sacrificed my fucking pick. Oh my god, dude. Why did I do that? Why, why, why did I do that? Am I some kind of morang? Oh, god damn it. Oh well, it doesn't matter. It happened. Nothing I can do about it now. We need to make some rare rune stones. Let's make three of those. God damn it. I went to click cancel, but I clicked it too late when I realized what it was. It's just what happens when you don't pay attention. Stupid, stupid man. Stupid man who does stupid things sometimes. I really do. Uh, we need dust. I can convert the dust. Yeah, I can. Just No! I'm not doing the region, I'm doing the dust. Bloody stupid sometimes. You know, if we had enough essence, I could have tried to make an epic one. But we wouldn't be able to 
get enough, um, we wouldn't be able to get enough epic essence to try and get an epic bow. It would take too much, potentially. Uh, yeah, probably. Probably. Oh, uh, yeah, nah. We'll just go for the rare. We can always enchant again later. If we want, let's hope for something good. Attack, stamina, and weightless. Uh, fucking why, man? Why is it just not very good? Uh, augmenter. Let's get this going as well. Needs more space. Needs more space. It's kind of in the middle of my whole feng shui area here. Augment. What about if we augment... Where is it? Let's augment the reduced attack stamina, maybe. For something else. I need a rare dust... I need a shard. Um... I need a shard. How did I get those again? Epic dust... Da, 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 da. I need a shard. How does one make the shards? I don't remember... Oh, it's the trophies. That's what it is. Sacrifice the ball trophy. There we go. Now, I guess five of these would make a rare shard. Let's try to not accidentally burn something I actually want. Uh, then we need to do this and get a rare shard. Then we go to augment, and then we're going to augment the gladiator's Draugr Fang of Weightlessness. Eight. How does this add slashing damage or blunt damage? I've got blunt damage on a bow? What the fuck? How does slashing make any sense either? That makes me extremely confused as well. I don't understand that. Okay. So my daughter came in. Uh, let's put that away. I think this is about as good as it's going to get. Let's try and make some needle arrows as well. Needle arrows. I guess the good thing is with the needle arrows, you actually don't need wood. I wonder if a hundred would be enough. I feel like that's good. We can complement it with the obsidian arrows if we have to. Um... Which we might just make a couple more. We'll make one more set. That'll be 89. 189 arrows plus the 20 frost arrows. I feel like if we can't do it with that, we're f not very good. Um, and then I'm going to also make some honey sweetened sausage. Uh, we'll do that. And then we'll round it out with some Odin's Delight. This combo should be enough to get us done. I'm hoping. We use a lot of honey to make that honey sweetened sausage, so... It's pretty expensive. Uh, we're gonna call that good, I reckon. I'm gonna put... No, oh, I can't even fit it because we don't have enough room. We actually need a second food chest. Food slash seeds chest. I'm just going to put that in there. How many frost resists we got left? We got six. So we'll take one more. Three. Oh, we've also still got 55 silver. We could actually upgrade the fang one more time. Um, are we all heavy? What are we so heavy for? It doesn't matter. Let's go quickly put this in, a, in, the, uh, in the smelters. And we'll get this going. Look at that big boy up there. He's just hanging out, doing his thing. Uh, we need this. Pick these up in a sec. Once we've got some of the weight out of us, we should be able to 
pick that stuff up. We only needed about 20 more, I think, to be able to, to do this. Let's try this out. Rip. Big ripperoni. I know it's very dark, I'm sorry. We're only going to be out here for 0.2 of a second. I'm just going to pick this stuff up and then run back. And then go sleep through the night. Alright, we got the rest of the silver done. Let's upgrade this Draugr Fang one more time. 56 peers plus 20 poison plus 8 blunt. So what's that? That's 76... 84 damage 84 damage plus this is 62 pierce so anywhere between 20 yeah okay I think that's pretty damn good um I don't want to go to the mountain biome while it's raining here because I believe then it will be also blizzardy in the mountain biome and I don't want to be dealing with a blizzard if we're going to be trying to fight this guy because he's already going to be hard enough as it is without that as well all right, I've eaten some decently basic-ish food. We're going to have to try and get the rest of the dragon eggs as well because we haven't even gotten one yet, so we have to go and get those as well, which I didn't think about. So now we've got to try and get them. Now, we do have a place marked in one of the snow biomes. It's blizzardy here. God damn it. It's the problem is I can't see. There was an egg somewhere down here, I thought, but I can't see it now. Let's see if we can see it if we come onto this ledge. We're going to need those three eggs too, so we're going to have to do that. Let's just go to the original snow biome, I guess. And grab the egg that I had marked on the map over there. That'll be a start. Usually I try to get, get them as I go along. Whereas before we could actually carry two because we don't even have the Megan Yord because we spent our gold on weirdly useless shit um, with the the merchant. Uh, I'm going to have to get one at a time because unless I was completely naked, we couldn't carry two at once. So we'll come up here and we'll grab this one that we know is up here. It could be more on this mountain as well. Like I said, I hate that it's blizzardy weather. Not a big fan of that. I'm using the needle arrows. I don't want to be using the needle arrows. I just accidentally wasted one as well. Oh, shit. Oh. Ancient bark spear. Could have been something better. It could have been something better, but it wasn't, unfortunately. All right, let's grab this egg. There it is. All right, one egg acquired so far. Oh, the blizzard's clearing up, which is good. We'll run this back, and then we'll uh, have a look around, see if we can find another one. Hi, how you doing? I could one, I, I, like, I, I can't quite one-shot them. I just can't quite one-shot them, unfortunately. Yeah, 308. We could go dive through a few crypts. I could sell, actually, see what the valuables I've got are worth, but I don't think I've got $400 worth of stuff, unfortunately. That would be sick. Not gonna lie, that would be awesome, but I don't think we do, because I got about five hundred dollars in coins, I think, and it's nine fifty for the Megan Yord. Which would get us to five hundred and fifty weight, so we could get away with carrying two of those eggs at once. Let's see, value of seventy. Uh, 70 for 5. So 140. About 200 there. Oh, uh, 
you know, uh, let's go squeeze it quickly then, I guess. We'll see, but I don't think we do. I don't think we do. Uh, let's put this in here for a moment. And the worst thing is we're going to have to take each egg one at a time to motor as well. So I might move the motor um, portal once we go through there with an egg. We'll move it up next to motor's spawn. So then we can just whip through. And I'll put the portal somewhat close in case we die. But not too close so it breaks like last time. Alright. Uh, 420. You know what? I think we've got enough if I grab the coins, which I forgot. I forgot the coins. You're actually shitting me. I've got 948. Oh. Just that bee's dick short. Um... Well then, I guess we've got an option. We can quickly check and see if we can find like a ship looking layout of rocks in the meadows. Because that has a buried treasure generally. We could look for that if we want. Or I think I searched that. I don't know. I've got it marked as burial, but I don't know whether I searched. I don't think I did. Holy crap. Ah. Level 3 skeleton. Can I block him with the sword? I can block the, the damage. I can't parry him, but I can block the damage. Two seconds, guys. I'm going to quickly get that filter going for you so you can see. And we're going to quickly run through here, looking for chests. That's all we really want right now. We'll take the certain calls, of course, while I see them, but we're just purely looking for chests. It is very dark. Very, very dark for me. Oh, I thought that was a skelly. That's how dark it is. I can't freaking see. Right, there's a chest. That's enough. Obviously, we're going to check through this while we're here. There's no reason to not. There we go. A little bit more. Ow. Take a bow shot to the face like a champion. Nothing up here. What's in here? Hi. Thanks for the item, champ. Hi. We're out of stam. Nothing here. Game save. Let's go this way. Wrecked. Hide in the corner. Not a lot of certling cores out of this place, though. We've gotten one. We've gotten one certling core. Uh, looks like a whole lot of bupkis. Not seeing shit. Alright, well, we got one certling core, but that's not really what we came for. We came for money and we got money, so let's go. Alright, on our way to the vendor. Let's get ourselves a Megan Yord. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Legendary Iron Pickaxe. Oh, that could have been really good, actually. Yeah. Alright, let's sell what we've got so we ended up with a thousand and eighty boom megan you're done huh travel to the mountain you know what let's accept it just because i want to see where it is really there's a mountain biome right up above us okay cool that's good to know that's good to know he's a brute what's that all right let's see where he is 
So he'd be, that planes must run all the way down. Or it's a separate planes. Could be a separate planes. It's good to, it's actually a, an easy way to locate things on the map. That could be like a super easy way at the start of a playthrough to just go bang. Here's, here's where a mountain is guaranteed to be. And here's where, you know, a swamp is guaranteed to be. Stuff like that. We got our Megan Yord, which is awesome. We also got the Grim Bar. 55 pierce and 10 blunt, so a total of 65 damage. Interesting. Alright, well that's our first uh oh, fuck off. Frickin' skeleton surprise. Hello guys, how are we today? Time to get absolutely wrecked. Over here buddies, I'm over here. Ow. Took that flush to the face. I just hate the arrow boys. The melee boys don't fuss me at all. I, I kind of wish you just got better drops out of the skellies, to be honest. You just don't get really anything good. Oh, fire infused. Poison. Get out of here, rancid remains. I know I could use my Ikther, but I don't want to waste it right now because we're gonna use we're gonna probably use it for something else. Oh shit. He's a spirit infused one, he could fuck me up. Gotta be very careful with that boy. Yeah. Gotta get a big swing. Okay, thank god. If he hit me, he might have actually killed me. Hello, Rancid Remains. Oh god, there's more of you. I think this event lasts like a minute and a half. Ow. Can we stop? Skeletons are tired of fighting. Thank god, I'm tired of collecting their bones. All the time. Like that really early game, with this mod, whew, could really screw you. That now, kind of just more tedious than anything else. Now I'm just going to put the bones up here. Actually didn't get that many trophies, considering the amount of skellies we killed. I would have thought we would have ended up with more trophies. Food away. Uh, coins away, and we're good. 550 weight. And I guess we're gonna s repair. Jeez, the way I'm going, I'm not even gonna get to mot motor today. I'm just gonna get everything set up for motor. Wasted most of a day waiting for the rain to stop. You can see I popped my, um... I popped my frost resist potion and it's down to three minutes. So I just wasted seven minutes of standing around waiting for the rain to clear. So I could actually go into the snow biome without freezing to death. Which is kind of annoying. Kind of very, very annoying. Alright, let's see if we can find... Yeah, we'll just eat this. It's a loofah now. I don't want to waste my really good food. If I can help it. Need to see if we can find ourselves some more eggs. Let's see if we can hit this drake without him spotting us. Beautiful. I'll take it, I'll take it. Alright. Need to find some more eggs. So we can get that journey over and done with. Let's get rid of that because we don't need it anymore. I just think today's episode is just going to be getting getting the eggs collected. Because we're already half an hour in and I ain't done much. And I, like I said, I don't feel the most crash hot in the world, so... Holy shit. Oh, we're killing him right here. Got him. 
as clean. As very clean, actually. Uh, I hear Drake's fighting. I want to have my sword out for... Oh, fuck. That's the level three golem. I forgot about you, you big psalm bitch. We're going to not fuck around with him. We're just going to forget that he exists. And continue on our merry way. Over to this side. I actually don't remember seeing any eggs now. Because I remember coming over here. He's still wandering. I can hear him. Look at that big fuck. He's huge. I hear wolves. I see a really big stone golem over there as well. I don't see eggs though. And they're usually pretty straightforward and easy to spot. So unless they're all the way back here. I don't think there's any more here. There's a wolf down there. You see him? He's a pretty big boy. Maybe he's level 3. Something like that. I want to sneak up. I want to get over here and go down around the side to avoid the stone golem boy. And see if we can sneak a look at any eggs. There's some wolves in front of us here, so I've got to be careful. But we've got to be careful of their level before we go fighting them. Because if they're anything above two, I don't think we're going to be able to block their parry. I mean, we're not going to be able to parry them with our block. And that is not what we want. Nah. I reckon we're going to have to get the other two eggs from Motor Mountain. Which is fine as long as it's not a freaking um, blizzard. So we can actually see, then that's not too bad. I'm pretty sure he just killed that drake as well. Let's see. You got a chest for me? Nope. I'm just going to get the fuck away from you then. Act like you don't exist, alright? Oh, you're only at level 2. Still, still has a shitload of HP. And I want to deal with that. Because he will, if he hits me, he might do hit me for like 80. And that'll pretty much kill me. And this level 3 boy, this guy here, if he hits me, he'll, he'll one-shot me for sure. 100% one-shot me. So I'd rather not deal with them right now. It's the only thing. Actually, knowing their HP level makes me more sketched out for, for avoiding them. Holy fuck. How you doing, big man? You're a very big, very big stone golem. Uh, there's some drakes down here. Ah, oh, fuck. I'm trying to pull out my bow. Oh, we hit a snipe on him. Hey, Wolfie Poo, go away. I'm just going to act like you don't exist either. Come here. Dead. Thank you. No eggs over here. I found them so easily, it felt like, last series. Like, we ran into three of them, I think, on the same mountain. And we just took them straight through. I think we ended up with about five or six of them by the end. So hopefully Motor Mountain is the is the be-all end-all for finding the dragon eggs for us. Oh shit, this one's split in half. That level three boy's split in half. And then these ones are going to split into level one drakes. Holy fuck, this is insane. get this level one boy taken out first, I think. Alright, and these good ones going to split into two more. Holy shit. One level three became like ten. Alright. Let's go collect our spoils. See what we got here. Tower shield. I came back here. I was going to go back to base, but then I thought about... Um, 
Now I thought about, uh, sorry if you could hear that. It's my partner's mum saying that her dog pooped on the rug. Um, is that all? Is that all I got? Oh yeah, I'm going to end up with a fair few cross things. We've got a set of iron armor. I wanted to see if we could find any silver in here so we could upgrade our shield. Then maybe we could take out the fen ring as well. I thought it would be a cool little thing to try. See if we can beat the fen ring. Instead of, uh, we'll try and get the eggs and beat the fen ring this episode or something, maybe. Or maybe we'll do the fen ring and motor in one episode. I don't know yet. But I'm not finding a lot of silver. Not even finding any boopity beeps to even indicate a direction for silver. Oh. Why does it have to be somewhat near the golem? It's up here, isn't it? Nope, it's this way. Of course it is. He'll kill me. I can't, I can't block him. Can we lead him away maybe? Lead him away over here. Love how I could get him distracted fighting something else. The thing is, is whatever he fights, he's basically going to kill instantly. Oh, of course, there's more silver up here. You know what? Are you going to just stop being interested in me? Nope, you are making your way over here. Of course you are. Okay, well, you want to come over here? I'm going to run around. Bye! Ah, oh, fuck. Attack him! That's a level four! Jesus Christ! You attack him! Attack him. I'm going to go down here and get some silver, okay? Oh, shit. We have to eat something good. Oh, and of course, it's starting to get lizardy out. Alright, we've got to be really careful and watch what watch what's around us, because he'll kill us pretty quick. Um, I'm going to now put this on. And we're going to carry as much as we can. Oops. Game's exploding. Give me that, give me that, give me that. Is that as much as I can hold? Can't be. There's more. Yeah, there's more. There's more. Really? I know there's some behind me, by the way. If you're wondering. I did see that. I just want to see how much is here. Okay. So that's too much. Split it in half. Split it in half. Split it in half. We can carry that. Alright, that's going to have to do for now. We've still got some at home. And then we're going to quickly mark... Silver. I can hear him. And we're going to get the fuck out of here. We're also going to pick up this epic item that's on the ground. I don't know what it is. Iron Greaves. That's not bad. Indestructible. That is not bad at all. Let's go. This has worked out quite nicely. I don't know what the cost is to upgrade our silver shield. Hopefully it's not too stupidly expensive. And we can get that upgraded. Because what's its block at now? 91.5.
Well, if we upgrade it maybe twice, we should be at like 110. So we should be able to maybe parry that Fenring. I'm hoping. I'm hoping. Alright. I should have gotten a bunch of all processed over the sleep. That's good. Uh, we can just put this in this in here. It's where really the metal should be going. Uh, this can go in here. This can go down here. That can go down there. That can go there. And then the rest of this snow stuff can go in here. And that can go in there. And meat doesn't fit in there, so it can go up here. Okay. We should have a bunch of silver out here on the ground, because I set up both of them. Stack of 19. I can't pick that up. Uh, yep. Let's do that. This should hopefully be enough for us to upgrade our shield. And then I think we're going to try and fight the Fenring again. Because I'm an idiot and I like a challenge. Sometimes. So I want to see if, if we can beat that fucking Fenring. I feel like if we eat good food and we are able to parry his blocks, we're going to be good. Alright, this brings it up to 106. Alright, we've got a hundred and... We've got a block power of 103 or 113 because of the extra block improvement. I think we can block him with that. I think we can parry him. We've got a decent-ish iron sword. It's not overly amazing. Um, it actually could be upgraded again. Fuck it, why not? Let's just do it. We can get some more iron if we have to. It's a 67 slash plus 7 fire, so that's 74 damage. 74 damage, we eat an Odin, Odin's Delight, and I think we're good. We're going to have to run there, of course. Um, and he was here, he was down the other end of this snow biome. We're going to beat this Fenring. We're going to do this today. We're not going to get Moda done. I might even grab some of the eggs off camera. I haven't decided how I'm going to do it yet. But we're going to get something cool done, like beat this freaking Fenring that murked us the first time. And could have killed us again had we continued to try and fight him. I'm still pissed about getting rid of my rare pick, though. I'm, like, really annoyed at that. What a just dumb thing to do. Just simply not paying attention to what I was doing. You are not worth fighting, Grey Dwarf. Man, I'm sorry, but you are not. Okay, we're close. We saw him here last time. Remember, he was running away around here. So he's still... He, he didn't... Oh, God. He's recovered his fucking health, too, of course. All right, let's see if we can get him. He's fighting something. Is he fighting wolves? He's fighting a drake. What the fuck? He's fighting the skeletons. Ow! Okay, we don't need this right now. If they're fighting him, that's fine, but I don't want them fighting me. Already fought his wolves. That poor skeleton. Fucking Drake. Go away. Alright, let's see. Can we block him? This... Oh, shit. Odin's Delight. We can parry him. We have a chance. We're in this. We have a chance. Oh, you can't fuck up the parry. We will die. We need to get hits off there as well. He's not parried for long, is he? He's not parried for long. Ah, he jumped too far for me to get a hit off on him then. 
Oh, just hit him for about 100 damage then. Okay, our block. He still hits for 2.3 if we don't parry him. Okay. We gotta hit off then. That was good. We will kill this guy. Holy shit, you jump far, don't you? You got a bit of a leap about you. Oh, I'd love to hit that third shot on him. Damn it. Oh, bad timing. Come on. Oh. I want to stay on his ass so he doesn't do the jump bullshit like that. Oh, we're going to get him here. He's going to die here, ready? Yeah, buddy. We did it. What is our award? An iron Ikta. Ha. Ha. And then, woo. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Man, I am super glad we upgraded our shield. There is no way we could have blocked him without it. 100% not a chance. Uh, that was my body marking. Alright, well, we did get something accomplished today. We were able to defeat the bounty target that was... That murdered us and probably would have murdered us multiple times. Like, if you fuck up two blocks, that'd still kill me. Two blocks is all it takes. Is all I have to mess up and I'm dead. That's pretty crazy. How much damage he hits for. That's actually insane. You know, I probably... Uh, I could have taken bone mass, actually, now I'm thinking about it. And popped bone mass. And I know people are going to be pissed. He didn't use Ike though while I was saving it. Because I didn't think I was going to be standing around so much doing different things. I kind of thought I was going to be fighting a boss today. So. That's alright. We got him. Bone Mass would have been super helpful though for his attacks. At least they would have done like half the physical damage that they did. So instead of hitting me for like 60, it would have been hitting me for like 30. Which, you know, means I could have had a chance to fuck up a couple more times without dying. But it's fine. We beat him. That's the important thing. Gonna say I wanted to do it again? Not really. Um, I'd rather fight a Drake than fight a Fenring again. If I have the choice for a bounty target, I would much rather fight a Drake. Although, I'd imagine maybe the Drake has backups of other Drakes, so it could end up being really bad if you get enough of them together. It could be a real hard fight, potentially. I also hear a lot of shit going off up there, over, over there somewhere. Up there somewhere. There's a frosty thing up there. Do you see that? Oh, I shouldn't do it, but I want to check what it is. Is it a wolf? It is a wolf. It's a frost-infused wolf. No. I couldn't hit it. I'm not going to bother. I'm going to leave him to his own devices. I hit the wall. If I'd, if I'd actually hit him, I would have fought him, but no. We're just going to act like he doesn't exist and get on our merry way so we don't die. Alright, let's go hand in our bounty target and then we're going to end off today's episode. We're going to get our bounty reward. Hello, Haldor. Give me my reward. Thank you. Thank you very much. You devious prick. Legendary Drake Helmet. 100% chance. If only I had the gold. 100% chance of a legendary Drake helmet. Could be really, really good. Oh. That could be really, really, really good, but... It's alright. We don't have the gold for it. Not even close. Because we just spent 950 on the, um, the Meganyord. 
I think I'm saying that right. I don't know. That's what I'm going to call it forever. So if you don't like the way I pronounce it, too bad. So anyway, guys and girls, that is going to be the end of this episode. If you liked it, remember to leave a like. If you want to see more Valheim in the future, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media links down in the description below. Thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you all have a lovely day. All right, peace.